so I don't know how anybody gets anything done in game development today. There's just there's way too many cool things to play with. Um, so if you've <laughs> seen how I operate on this channel is I find something I like to play with and then I go play with it and then I create a tutorial on it and I don't do any actual game dev because I just have too much fun messing with all the cool tools. Um, so here's another one that I found in Blender and if you look at this 3D model it's a pretty decent model aside from the um, black spaces so I'll just call those out you can see these black sort of picture frames these are all um, these are used from the 20 15 to 20 photos that I used to generate this and then obviously I didn't have any photos of the back uh, of my head or underneath my head because um, I didn't I just took them of myself I didn't have somebody else taking them I was just playing around with it but for 10 15 minutes worth of work um, that is pretty ridiculous and if I take off um, the uh, UV mapping, you can see that that's a pretty awesome model. And I know my head very well. That is definitely um, my head. I have a very pronounced um, forehead that my friends like to call me Frankie. <laughs> um, and there's just, yeah, th that's just, it's just me. So anyway, it's pretty cool. Um, I didn't stop there in Blender because I found some other cool stuff. So I obviously had to get it into Unreal and show that that could be done. Um, and that's not it. Again, if you've been following any of the stuff that I like to play around with, I've been spending a lot of time with the um, Live Link Apple AR kit. And the Kite Boy um, head uses uh, shape keys to adjust the face. So check this out. Whoops, lost my color there, but let's see if it's back now. Oh yeah, there we go. So just from uh, photos without any additional editing in um, Blender yet, um, we've got a pretty decent asset. It's already working. Like, look at that. Who does it better? There's some stuff that um, he can do that I can't, but... Um, Like, this is pretty <laughs> pretty darn cool. See, I can't do that one. Um, but anyways, yeah, it's like, uh, it's just awesome. So um, my goal now is to take this asset and um, make my face and, and make a, a bit of a higher quality one. Uh, we'll do the eyes properly. And the goal would be to then link this up with um, the Live Link in Apple AR kit and be able to animate a face and that just gives you a ton of flexibility. So I'll show you that tool. I'll show you how to get into Unreal Engine. I will uh, <laughs> then get this working with uh, Live Link because um, with the shape keys, uh, I know that it can be done. I'll show you how to generate the shape keys. They're all auto generated. Um, this tool is pretty darn cool. It's called the Keen tool and it's a, um, it's a plugin for uh, for Blender. So anyways, uh, just something else that I was uh, kind of excited about and thought I'd just share it and, and show you some of the stuff that I am playing with. So we'll catch you around.